popular Sarasota County attraction may have to be rebuilt because of Hurricane Irma. The Venice Fishing Pier sustained heavy damage, and right now it's closed. John Rogers shows us why it has locals worried. Good evening. Take a look. The Venice Fishing Pier is completely empty. Typically, day or night, you'll find crowds of people fishing out here. This is a popular tour spot, and people are concerned that its closure could impact the local economy. Visitors to beautiful Venice Beach can find plenty of picturesque views, which unfortunately includes this caution tape blocking off the Venice Fishing Pier. Officials say thanks to Hurricane Irma's winds, the railings are degraded, a large number of boards need to be replaced, and the end of the pier is unstable. So we want to make sure they're not on an unsafe structure, although it's, it's a, a difficult thing to do with such a popular attraction. Many tourists and locals come to this beach solely for this pier. This is really disappointing to see. I, I was expecting to be out there and, you know, catch a snook or two, but uh, not from here. And he told me that this would be lined up with fishermen, and unfortunately, it was, it's closed. Officials say the cement pylons should be stable, and they may be able to temporarily open a portion of the pier soon. But the whole decking will likely have to be replaced, costing around $675,000. This pier is a huge tourist draw and also drives customers to this popular eatery, Sharky's on the Pier. So locals are worried about the economic impact. And I hope anyway that the pier's shut down, people come here anyway and enjoy the, the beach. But some are making the most of it. I've moved down here, I'm still catching fish. <laughs> Just different rods, different lures, different tackle. You're not letting it stop your fun? No. In the coming days, contractors are going to see if they can reopen the pier up until the bait shack that you see over there. The bidding process to rebuild the pier would likely start in December, and construction would last a couple of months. Reporting in Venice, John Rogers, News Channel 8.